Yo, it's your boy GT here from the Gangster Times. Please like, comment and subscribe to my channel. Also hit me up on Instagram, which is gangstertimes underscore official. And on my Snapchat, type in the search box. So guys, I've got Times. something different for you tonight. It's not actually one of my videos. It's one of someone else's videos. And it's of a man who was involved in the South Manchester gang violence back in the early 2000s. His name is Kieran Proverbs Brown. And he used to be a member of the Gooch gang. But then he went on to create a splinter group of his own gang which was known as the Old Trafford Crips. This was a man who was described as terrorising the streets of South Manchester, having access to guns at the age of 12, 13 years old, and not afraid to use them. Whilst he was still a teenager, he got convicted of attempted murder, a story which I'm going to go through in a moment. But the purpose of this video is that I watched an interview with regards to Kieran. It was probably the best thing I've watched on YouTube this year, and that's why I want to recommend you guys to also watch that video. I'm going to put it in the link in the description below, and I want you to go check out his video and I want you to subscribe to his channel also. So I contacted Kieran and I told him that I'd watched his video and I thought it'd be really good to share that video with all you guys. He was absolutely fine with that. I also told him I wanted to mention a bit about his background and why he was arrested and he was cool with that also. And when we talk about being in prison, he's been in nine different prisons including Strangeways, Moorlands, Full Sutton, Dovegate. He's been around the block. Yo, yes. So yeah, nah, just a quick one. Gangster Times reached out to man and told, like, asked me to make this video. You understand what I'm saying? So again, appreciate that, that you took the time out to take this time to do this for me, to help me spread my story. You understand what I'm saying? For those who don't know already, K Proverbs, Instagram, at K the PT 19 also True Blue Lifestyle, and also on YouTube, True Blue Lifestyle as well. Subscribe to my channel. Share, like. You understand what I'm saying? Everything. Like, let's help spread this story together. Like, for those that don't know, my story is about coming out of jail after living a life of crime. How life was back then and how life is now and how life was in prison. Do you understand what I'm saying? So for anyone that knows, just keep sharing. Get as many people hearing this story as possible. And again, shout out to Gangster Times for giving me the opportunity to tell my story and helping me spread awareness, you get me? So yeah, respect for that. So at the time, Kieran Proverbs Brown was found guilty following a trial at Liverpool Crown Court of conspiracy to commit murder and attempted murder. And he pleaded guilty to possession of a firearm with intent to endanger life. For this, he was given an indeterminate prison sentence for public protection and ordered to serve a minimum of 12 years before he would ever be eligible to apply for parole. And whilst he was in prison, Kieran Proverbs Brown was also found guilty of a robbery spree in the area of Trafford in Manchester. So in this video, I'm going to cover the shooting incident, and his Cody was also found guilty of conspiracy to murder and possession of a firearm with intent to endanger life, and was also sentenced to an indeterminate term for public prosecution. So their victim was a 27-year-old man, and he was shot on Monday the 3rd of April 2006. He had gone to Stamford Street in Old Trafford that night with his cousin, who had been involved in a row with Kieran Proverbs Brown early that evening. Proverbs Brown, armed with a sawn-off shotgun and covering his face, rode a bicycle up to his van, where the victim was sitting in, and he was followed by his Cody. He was then believed to have aimed a gun into the van and fired it. Despite having been shot, the victim started the van and drove to the Manchester Royal Infirmary. So Proverbs Brown and his Cody were arrested after a witness contacted police and he told detectives that he had known that Proverbs Brown and his Cody were intending on attacking one of the men in the van at the time of the shooting. So at the time, Detective Inspector Bob Tong of Greater Manchester Police's Trafford Division said Proverbs Brown and his Cody were dangerous men who were involved in Manchester gangs. Proverbs Brown clearly had easy access to guns and was willing to use one. So I've spoken to Kieran, I contacted him last night and I spoke to him about watching the video, I watched the full 30 minutes and I told him it was an absolute brilliant watch. And from his video, I believe that if many youngsters watch that, they will learn from Kieran's mistakes. And I believe that if anybody watches that video, it will most definitely deter them from doing a crime that they're thinking of doing. So I just want to say big respect to Kieran for getting back to me and letting me share some of his experiences. And what I'd like you guys to do now is go over to his YouTube channel, click on the link in the description below and check out this video and let him know what you think of that video and once you've watched it come back onto my channel and let me know what you think it's your boy gt keep it locked keep it real